I'd like Joe DeRosha, Humboldt Township Supervisor, uh, like to let the County Road Commission Board know that Humboldt Township it has unanimous support um, from the Humboldt Township Board for the building of County Road 595 and support uh, of the 595 corridor. Thank you. Lance Mulward with Dickinson County Road Commission, and Dickinson would like to go on record as support for 595. We see it not just as a Marquette issue, but anything you do to improve Marquette also helps improve the whole UP. Can you tell us your name once more, please? Lance Mulberg, I'm the engineer at Dickinson County. Okay, thanks. Who's next? I'm Tony Rajasti speaking on behalf of the Upper Peninsula Construction Council, and as in the past, we still support the road. Thank you for your time looking into this. And as far as the road, we, we believe that it'll alleviate a lot of traffic traffic in the city of Marquette and also allow more sporting in that particular area. So again, we want to thank you for your time and your support the road. Thank you. Anyone else? Okay, Cynthia Um Generally, when I go through a plan like this, I'm looking for detail. I'm looking for an understanding of what the engineering principle is going to look like. I'm looking for uh, reading, for example, uh, the plan sheet 40 for the Yellow Dog River, the brown water drainage layer, see plan detail sheet. Okay, I don't see it in here. Um, look for detail sheet PC5, I don't see it in here. A lot of these maps and engineering drawings are not included as part of this plan. I guess what I would like to see um, is that this gets online sooner than later and that as you make changes to the plan, it's noted in a different color or in bold so that people can track the detail. This is a detail-oriented process. The review of this document is important to a lot of people, like myself who live up in that area, to fully understand what's going on. When you look at the maps on the wall, there are no dimensions. It's just a just a road section. I want the dimensions. I want to know how much fill. I want to know exactly what's going to happen um, in these in these crossings. Um, so I would advise the, the road commission um, to go ahead and take the time to get this online as it sits right now and then add the detail to it so people can track it as it goes along instead of much, much later when it becomes a full plan and you can't find out the changes that were made to this plan. 